Morning. Um, meal management bags. Within kind of fitness and sport and so on, for a long time there was only one choice, and it was six pack. Um, and rightly so, they were one of the first to the market that did the product really nicely, really well packaged, looks the part. Um, but there's another company, ISO Bag, came out a couple of years ago. We used to stock the ISO Bag ones. The ISO Bag ones were okay. Um, they didn't look great, uh, and they felt a little flimsy. So ISO Bag two is kind of an updated version. You, they do four types. We stock, well, we stock all of them actually. But at the moment, I'm talking about the kind of handheld, take to work with you meal bags. So you can also get duffel bags and rucksacks. And in those you can take your gym kit and so on as well. We're, we're talking just specifically about meal management bags. So this is a three meal, although I like to call it a three plus one, because in the top of the three meal six pack, you get a tub that is purely for putting pills in. And I, I don't know about you, but on a day-to-day -day basis, I don't need, you know, uh, all those pills. I So I've always got rid of that tub and just put a normal Tupperware in the top. So I, I've considered these to be a four meal. Um, you get a shoulder strap with the six pack bag. You get a hand strap that clips on and off. You get really good sturdy tubs. And you get your ice packs uh, tucked away in the sides on this particular one. Um, you've got space either side for shakers, powders, anything else you may need, um, and a little bit of just day-to-day -day stuff. And you've got some zip compartments in the top there. So that's great. The three meal ISO bag, however, if you see it next to it, it's almost half the size. You can fit, excuse me, you can fit exactly the same amount of meals in it. <laughs> The ice packs are in the new ISO bags, because the, the six pack bag ice packs and the original ISO bag ice packs weren't great. They're, they're solid, they're like a, like a styrofoam thing. Now they actually, this has just been on the shelf and they feel cool, even if they haven't been cooled. Um, but when you freeze them solid, they're near on indestructible. You come with the free meal, comes with, off the top of my head without opening it up, I believe they come with Yes, six tubs. So they always come with double the amount of tubs you need. Um, I like to call them cutting and bulking tubs. So you get some big tubs and some little tubs, depending on what you're doing. Again, you can actually fit four or even five tubs in one of these um, if you're creative with the sizing of your tubs. And because the tubs are a little bit more basic, they don't have this fancy cradle, um, it doesn't look as pretty, but you can fit more in them. Crucially, if you need new tubs for your six pack bag, you will pay £12 for three. If you need new tubs for your ISO bag, you'll pay £12 for 12 um, they don't look as pretty, but they last just as well, and you can stack more of them in the bag because they don't come with the cradle. Um, <laughs> other things ISO bag do really well, the zips are a little bit sturdy, the six pack kind of issues with the zips. Um, the side pockets, you've got a solid rigid side pocket, you've got a velcro compartment on the top, which is also insulated, and then you've got these mesh pockets, so you can put any size shaker in them. With the six pack bags, Unless you use a Smart Shake Slimline or a Blender Bottle Slimline, you're still going to fit them in. What does the ISO bag not do so well? It is lighter, but it does feel cheaper. It doesn't have that kind of aspirational quality that the six-pack bag has. It doesn't feel as well made. According to the importers and through my experience, they are just as well made, and I think the zips are slightly better, and the tubs aren't quite as good. Um, but they don't have that, ooh, that's a nice thing. In the same way that smart shakers, they're not necessarily anything particularly wonderful, but you grab hold of a smart shaker and it feels well made. And six pack bags are the same. ISO bags, I really, really like, um, but the one kind of downside for me is they don't have that kind of tactile quality feel. Um, but the ISO bag 2s are massively improved. Um, so yeah, it's smaller, it's lighter, it's cheaper, you can fit more in it. The only possible downside is that it's not a six-pack bag, so you don't get to be fitness buzzword guy with your six-pack bag. Um, it depends on whether that bothers you. The, as you'll notice, the six-meal ISO bag, which from experience is what I have or had, I've used a rucksack at the moment, it's literally barely any bigger than the three-meal six-pack bag. It's really not much in it. Um, but you can fit, in fact, it's slightly shorter and it is, it is definitely lighter. You can fit eight meals in this. 
Um, so if you're going away for a weekend, you know, it comes with 9 or 16 tubs, massive compartment at the top. You can fit loads and loads and loads of gubbins in there. Um, Price-wise, recommended retail price, and there are occasional offers and things on. The six meal ISO bags are coming at 84. Your three meal six pack bags are coming at 64, and your three meal ISO bag is coming in at 55, um, 54. So th there's quite a bit of variation in there as well. Don't get me wrong, this looks and feels brilliant. This is arguably a more practical, useful bag. It's lighter, you can fit more in it, and it's a little bit more flexible just because of these mesh pockets on the side, that kind of thing. Um, we have all of them in store, so if you want to come and have a, a fiddle about, you're more than welcome any time. Um, the one thing six pack bags do really well is they do a range of functional handbags and things like that that ISO bag don't do. Um, I was going to say they don't do as of yet. That would suggest I knew something about them doing more, and um, I, I don't. That would just be a lie. Um, so yeah, that's it. Any questions? Please do um, ask in the comments below. Um, if you are in the market for one of these products, as I've had a few people message about the six pack bags because the self black ones look great. I would, before you make a commitment to purchase, fully recommend you come down and give the ISO Bag Ranger a look. Um, by all means, they're both great options. Um, I currently have a six pack rucksack, and I've got an old ISO Bag meal bag, day bag somewhere in somewhere at home that I don't use very much at the moment, um, purely because what I'm doing day to day. Um, as and when it comes around to time to prep, uh, I'm looking at possibly treating myself to. Um, a duffel baggy type thing because six, um, six pack and ISO bag have both brought those out now, um, and I'm I'm leaning towards the ISO bag, but I don't know. I do like shiny things, um, and that's everything. Yeah, we can get the full range. So if there's anything you want that we don't stock as a regular item, drop us a message. We'll sort it out for you. Morning, um, meal management bags within kind of fitness and sport and so on. For a long time, there was only one choice, and it was six pack. Um, and rightly so, they were one of the first to the market that did the product really nicely, really well packaged, looks the part. Um, but there's another company, Isobag, came out a couple of years ago. We used to stock the Isobag 1s. The Isobag 1s were okay, um, they didn't look great, uh, and they felt a little flimsy. So Isobag 2 is kind of an updated version. You, they do four types, we stock, well we stock all of them actually, but at the moment I'm talking about the kind of handheld, take to work with you, 